Welcome back to Great Day Houston. April is National Parkinson's Awareness Month. Our next guest is here to share more about a program that helps people live more independently. Please welcome physical therapist Dominique Dom Meek with Tier Memorial Herman Greater Heights, along with patient Donald Hogan. Good morning. Hi, thank you for having us. You're welcome. Let me start with what Tier is. A lot of people yeah. might be out of sight, out of mind until they one day need it, and this is such a jewel in our community. Right. So Tier is the Institute of Rehabilitation and Research. We offer therapy services for individuals with neurological injuries. So brain injuries, stroke, spinal cord injury, um, any sort of neuroprogressive degenerative disease like Parkinson's disease um, or MS, yeah. ALS, things And you like have that, that research portion there, which yeah. means you have access to things that are cutting edge. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, mm -hmm. Donald, uh, Parkinson's, that's one of those things that people may hear and until it touches your life, you suddenly become an expert on it, don't you? That's very correct. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. tell us about the symptoms you were having and what your thought was at that time. The uh, symptoms I was having, it was more of a like trying to have an everyday lifestyle, like trying to put on my clothes, tie my shoes, walk. Yeah. What were your early symptoms? Early symptoms were more probably walking, uh, kind of like staring out to out of space. Yeah. And what did you think it was? I had no clue. Yeah. I had really no clue. I mean, I was told it was, you know, different symptoms you know could be this and that yeah and that's the tough yeah. thing about a lot of these neurological diseases is that they mimic other things Correct. and right. we can also excuse them i'm tired or you know i, I worked out right. too hard or something like that yes. and then we you were diagnosed with parkinson's what is parkinson's yeah so actually something that's really interesting and very common with a lot of our patients is they experience non-motor symptoms before they experience the physical uh, if symptoms. they look back on it they see yeah and it's really common they're like oh i think i had parkinson's for two years before i was actually Correct. diagnosed mm -hmm. wow. so they might have issues with um, sleeping or appetite one of the main things that they experience is a loss of their sense of smell um, but then later on they might notice issues with their balance or their walking yeah, they might have some falls and, and of course the tremors right? handwriting tremors maybe slower movement which makes it hard when you're trying to get dressed and put your shoes sure. on just takes so much more time yeah. yeah while there's not a cure there are things along the way that have made great improvements in the quality of life yeah. and one of those things is what you did because you were you, one of the things you wanted you know, we talk about independence, just to get out of bed and walk straight to the bathroom to go use the bathroom if you need sure, to, right? Sure. Because before yeah. you would get out and you weren't even walking a straight line? No. I mean, it, sometimes bouncing around from wall to wall, oh. you know, and just yeah. not being able to kind of get a sense of direction. Right, mm -hmm. right. When he first came to the clinic, um, he was waiting in the waiting room and I came out and said, hey, you know, Mr. Hogan, come on back. It took three of us to escort him into the therapy gym because he was shuffling, his feet were really frozen and it was really unsafe. Yeah, so yeah. I can't right, imagine so what, what did we do that makes the difference? Yeah, so at TIER we offer all sorts of services that are individualized for each patient. Mm -hmm. There's one particular program that Donald participated in, it's called LSVT BIG, um, which stands for Lee Silverman and voice uh, therapy. Um, it started out as a speech um, sort of treatment uh -huh. protocol. Um, it's very specialized by LSVT Global, but LSVT Big is the big movement patterns that we worked on. So working on getting in and out of bed, mass practice, there are seven specific exercises that we do, uh, working on balance and walking and high repetition. And everything is geared towards what his goals are. Yeah. which at that time was, you know, getting out of bed, you know, getting out of the house, Not getting dressed. Not the walls, right. Course, right? Yeah. Right, right. Yeah. 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 How quickly did you see some differences? Right away. Wow. I mean, wow. yeah, it was right away. Yeah. Uh, I mean, just amazing. I mean, I just can't be grateful enough to Dominique to, for what, you know, we've started to finish, you know, the, where I'm at now. For a lot of people, uh, Don, it is a, a, a diagnosis like that is very scary, and sometimes people will cocoon themselves and they won't get out, and they, and they concentrate on an ending as opposed to the light that's the right life. in front of you. Yeah. So if somebody is dealing with that right now, what do you have to say to them to get them to get out, take advantage of programs like this at Tier Memorial? I say get out, do what you can do, rest when you need to rest, but ask your doctors yeah. what kind of programs can I get into to help me out and to better myself on a daily basis? Yeah, mm -hmm. and That's, then for you, yeah. it has mm -hmm. got to be so fulfilling to see people come in hopeful yeah. and then see something 
really work. Right, right. It's really amazing. That's why I do what I do and why I love it. It's stories like this. And Donald's just one face of a whole population of, of people that come and yeah. are seeking to better their lives and make improvement because it can be very hopeless. So they, you know, come a little broken and we're like, no, you can, you can, you can fix it. You can fix it. Yeah. And um, what I think is interesting is yeah. that the body's an amazing thing. Oh, yeah. Is that this is not a pill or a surgery. It's right. working with your body and right. challenging your body. Exactly. So and it can rise to the occasion. Mm -hmm. yes. And research shows that exercise actually increases the, re the release of dopamine in the brain, which helps to improve movement. So exercise along with medications is the secret piece. Yeah. So like Donald mentioned, you know, you should be an advocate for yourself and speak with your physicians about noticing these symptoms that you're having um, and what you can do about it. Yeah. Well, thank you yeah. very much for coming in. Well, thank yeah. you for having Thanks us. for sharing this. I know a lot of people could use this. To learn more about Parkinson's rehabilitation at Tier Memorial Herman and the other rehabilitation services offered there, call 1-800-44-REHAB, 1-800-44-REHAB, or visit tier.memorialherman.org.